touchdown in the coffee cultural landscape, the region of Colombia where spectacular scenes unfold before your eyes and where everything you see is a postcard, like this and this and this and this and this. Someone pinch me, please. I'm road tripping to the heart of the coffee cultural landscape, 2,400 feet above sea level. This is the Kakora Valley, home to over 200,000 wax palm trees that can grow up to 250 feet tall. The wax palms dance in the wind and make you feel incredibly humbled. And don't miss the chance to plant your very own wax palm to ensure future generations will not miss out. Viva Estados Unidos y viva Colombia! As you wind through the valley, miradors, lookout points, are everywhere. Make sure to stop at the Alto de la Cruz for panoramas to die for. And if you're lucky, you'll get to try what quickly became one of my new favorite hot beverages, canalazo. It's aguardiente, sugarcane, and cinnamon. Un canalazo, por favor? Sí. Oh, gracias. Mmm. Bueno, From the Mirador, it's 250 steps down to the beautiful Pueblo of Salento. Picture-perfect colonial architecture, a magical place to end your day. Unlike the coffee that has made this region so famous, the pueblos of the coffee cultural landscape are wonderfully relaxed and sleepy. And Salento is full of little shops just like this, where they sell handicrafts, jewelry, and hats like this, completely handmade. Although it's a popular tourist destination, I didn't see one foreigner when I was there. Nope, I felt exactly as I like to when I travel, immersed in a culture that hasn't seemed to change much in hundreds of years.